Welcome to this video on ClickSense theming. So if we go into the ClickSense hub and select an application and go into a sheet to view the dashboard, then select show app information and go to app options, we can select between app themes. Two standard app themes are available by default. We can toggle between them to see the change in themes to the application in ClickSense. Now let's close this and close the app. Now if we go back into the app overview and make a change to the URL, we can toggle on the custom theming feature. We simply append feature forward slash theming plus theming underscore QMC and hit return. Now when we go into a sheet to view the dashboard and then select show app information and go to app options, we have a custom theme available to apply. Here you can explore to see the difference within the charts, titles, formats and palettes between standard and custom themes. In fact, a whole range of styles, colors, palettes, and properties are configurable with custom themes. These options are configurable within a zip file that can be imported as an extension through the Click Management Console for ClickSense Server. Let's take a copy of a custom theme zip file and change some basic properties. If we extract the contents of the zip that we have copied, we can begin to configure our changes. The zip file contains a CSV file, a JSON file, and a click QEXT definition file. Let's open the QEXT file to give our new theme a name and rename the file itself to the name of our new theme. In this case, my new. Save the changes and now let's edit the JSON file. Make sure the theme name property has the new name. And let's make a simple change to the background color. Save changes and now zip up our new zip extension file and give the theme zip the new name. Now we can go into the Click Management Console to import the theme extension. So go to Extensions, Import, choose the file we just created and import. Once the file has imported successfully, now go into the ClickSense Hub and select an application, ensuring that you refresh the browser. Now when we go into a sheet to view the dashboard, then select Show App Information and go to App Options, we have a new custom theme available to apply. If we select the new theme, we can see the changes we made in the JSON file applied within the yellow background.
Thank you for watching this video on ClickSense theming.